Today's Bible study is titled by Faith, Father Abraham had many sons. Now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. By faith Abraham, when he was called to go out into a place which he should after receive for an inheritance, obeyed, and he went out, not knowing whither he went. By faith he sojourned in the land of promise, as in a strange country, dwelling in tabernacles with Isaac and Jacob, the heirs with him of the same promise, for he looked for a city which hath foundations, whose builder and maker is God. Through faith also Sarah herself received strength to conceive seed and was delivered of a child when she was past age, because she judged him faithful who had promised. Therefore sprang there even of one, and him as good as dead, so many as the stars of the sky in multitude, and as the sand which is by the seashore innumerable. Hebrews 11 colon 1, 8 to 12 KJV. Abraham was both the physical and spiritual father of Israel according to belief and faith in God's promise to him. He is also the spiritual father of those who, in faith, come to believe the gospel of grace. An Abrahamic summary was that he was an idolater, part of those given over to a reprobate mind, non-Israelite before God's call to and covenant with him, lived before future Israel's Old Testament law came to be and was never under the law was given an unconditional promise, covenant, in Genesis 15. Believed the promise of God and his belief and faith was counted by God for his righteousness, Genesis 15 verse 6. Was justified by faith without works because of belief of what God told him and this pattern is the basis for justification of the human race, without regard to circumcision as noted, how was it then reckoned? When he was in circumcision, or in uncircumcision? Not in circumcision, but in uncircumcision. And he received the sign of circumcision, a seal of the righteousness of the faith which he had yet being uncircumcised, that he might be the father of all them that believe, though they be not circumcised, that righteousness might be imputed unto them also, Romans 4 verses 10 to 11, was the father of circumcision and the promised nation of Israel, through which both the seed, Galatians 3 verse 16, and the multiplied seed would come to rule over all the nations of the world, and, also, he became the father of all that have simple belief by grace through faith for righteousness, though they are not part of Israel or its promises of earthly dominion, example Gentiles. Abraham's father status of us all, Jew and Amp, Gentile, is only that which is by faith without works, unconditional. He fathered both the earthly beneficiaries, Israel's earthly kingdom per prophecy, and the heavenly beneficiaries, heavenly body of Christ per the revelation of the mystery. Yes, as the children's song goes, Father Abraham had many sons, but the believer in this dispensation of the grace of God needs to know the things that differ between the earthly, prophecy, and the heavenly, mystery, promises and associated messages in his word. Yes, as the children's song goes, Father Abraham had many sons, but the believer in this dispensation of the grace of God needs know the things that differ between the earthly and the heavenly promises and associated messages in his word. Believer, make sure your belief and faith is in accord with God's word for the body of Christ, today. Thank you for listening to this Bible study today.